Hi everyone. So I would like to introduce you today to Bigsby. This is my ferret. I am losing my voice at the moment. This is a terrible time to choose to do a voiceover. Um, <laughs> but anyways, this is Bigsby. He has been with me for almost two weeks now. And actually maybe maybe two weeks. I can't even remember. Maybe he's so, so sweet. I am doing some training with him. So I have these little freeze-dried meat treats from Origin. They're actually dog treats, but they're really great for ferrets. They have just all animal products or all animal ingredients. Uh, that includes tripe and kidney and liver and fat and meat. So just super healthy for the, the ferrets. And it's a great supplement, I think. Here it is. This is what it looks like. Uh, and they have a lot of different varieties. They have lamb and bison and fish and um, duck, I think. So I'm using those because he really loves them as like a, a training tool. So I make like little kissy sounds like that. And every time he comes, he gets a little treat. And um, so hopefully that will become his like little recall. I'm also doing that with raw meat. He's um, he's eating kibbles. He has Wysong Epigen 90 and Origin Kitten food as like his dry kibble, but I'm also giving him raw food as well. We just started that. He's doing really good. He's He's been such an easy ferret. Um, he's been doing, using his litter box. He's been eating all his food, so he's not picky. He's not me messy. Uh, and he's actually really gentle as well. So here I am making those little kissy sounds. So to um, invite him over to have a little dish of ground lamb. This is raw. I've pureed it in a blender and then I've added a little bit of water to it to make it really soupy. One of the things that you could do when introducing new foods to ferrets is making it extra soupy. And they seem to really enjoy that. So... That's how we got him started. Now he's like obsessed. <laughs> I don't even need to make it soupy anymore. He just really likes his little his little raw meat treat. This is the third ferret that I've had in my life. Mustelides, uh, the the weasel weasel family, I guess you could say, are, there's some of my absolute favorite animals. I feel like we're, I don't know, kindred spirits, and I've really missed having one in my life. And finally, the timing seemed fitting, and so here we have this lovely little guy, and um, I just can't, I can't get over how wonderful he is. I'm so thankful to have him, and he gets lots and lots of kisses, as you can see. Anyways, thank you all for watching. Uh, I will post an update on him soon. Scratch, 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 scratch.